We're going to take it to Twitter from this one. We're talking to at Tommy Becky 17. Did you all have instant chemistry or was there a slight learning curve to make it happen? You and real Billy gum were a perfect team uh, in and out of the ring. Of course, the whole group was the best ever in the business. Well, I like the sound of that. I don't know if that's the case. The people always ask DX or NWO. Of course I'm biased. I cannot answer that question. Uh, I just think DX was, was, a, it was timing, man. It's timing and everything. Timing is everything. You know what I mean? It was, he got hurt. Now Waltman's here. Now we're the new DX, the first one after the first raw after mania, you know what I mean? Then we, and so, so it's just timing is everything. And timing was of the essence with putting us together with the, uh, the Monday night wars. Like it was just a great time to be a wrestler and a wrestling fan. Absolutely. And with that said, woo-hoo, that's episode number two. And do. Oh, did I, let me ask you a question, Ryan. Did I answer any of those questions you just answered me or did I just give you the old DC duck and twirl? No, you gave some answers, but at the same point, hey, sometimes you got to throw a little pull. I, I don't even know what I'm going to say. Yeah, no, sometimes I knew what you were going to say. You got to put a little spin on some yeah, stuff. Amen. amen. And we've also been talking about some of these things. So I encourage everyone to go back to episode number one and learn about that chemistry and the build between Road Dog and Billy because it didn't start is an instant bond. It was something that had to come together. And we talked about that last week. You know what? I'm glad you brought me back. Thank you. The chemistry was there for all of us because we had worked so many times before Billy and I were there, Sean and I, uh, X-Pac and I had worked a million times. Me and Hunter worked a million times. We had the timing. We had the wherewithal to know where each other was going to be. We, from the get go, we had chemistry. Uh, and it was because of our past relationships. And there you go answering yeah, questions. Thank you. Thank you. I, I wanted to answer that question. Like an expert, man. Yeah. Yeah. Also, I never got a uh, confirmed answer, pants or no pants on these. I mean, I, I think I think it gets a little hot in the room. So mm -hmm. if you can if you can sit with no pants, I'm not offended personally. Okay, good. Thank <laughs> good. <laughs> <laughs> whoa, whoa, whoa. <laughs> All right, dog. Ryan let's Katz, tell, let's you tell old son of a beast thing. Look, I appreciate you doing this with me, man. It's so much fun to hang with you. And, and for those of you listening or watching, like Ryan has such a great mind for this industry and such a great entertainment mind. He he was on my team, team dog, uh, when we were creating and and uh, and and coming up with characters that are now on NXT, and we yep. get to see our fruits kind of, yep. uh, or we just kind of see our our the fruits of our labor come to fruition. And so just know that Ryan knows what he's talking about, man. Uh, he's an entertaining guy. He was the first one I asked for. So, uh, appreciate that. Yeah, no, thank you. Just asking the fans out there to follow us, subscribe and, and go on this journey with us. You know what I mean? We're going to learn how to do podcast and, uh, and you can learn about, uh, the career of the old road dog. While they're going along on this journey and following you, 